This is your furniture coming in. It's all in two trucks like this. <laughs> it's tight, but they'll manage. Starting to fill up. Oh, you have plenty of room <laughs> for now. Okay, almost full. This is full. can still move around. Just. Just. <laughs> Whoop, look. You, always, always buy you can still, still you. go to your bedroom. <laughs> and here. You can still pass. No bad. I don't think there's anything in this room. Where is it? No. It's completely empty. Oh, you could have brought more. Thank you very much. Prazer. Things come and pecking around. <laughs> nice and dark when I'm all having a peck around. So all settled. Hmm. A bit hidden away. There you go. Happy pecking. Yeah, they're all happy. They're good little girls. Put their water in now and they're all set for their journey. That's it. We'll close them up in a minute. So they have a door closed so they can't see out. Be 
keep them all hidden away. I'll get some water in there now. That's half four now, Nina. Chickens nicely hidden away. Yep, they're making themselves a nice bed. As you can see, they're kicking everything out. So, all nice and quiet. And all ready to go, all having a little peck around. They've got food and water all in there. They're all set to go. It's a bit dark and relaxed. And Ted's in as well. One in. You ready, Stephen, for the off? Yep. A bit tired now. We've had a long time trying to load it all up and do it all. So that's it. We're packed in. Onwards on our long journey now. Price of fuel's gone up considerably. Only thing we can get hold of. Oh my god. £152.80 for 86 litres. <gasps> Terrible. We've never spent that much on fuel. He don't look happy. Okay, that's the first bit done. We've just come in and we're now waiting to go onto the tunnel. Ted is He's very... He's used to this. He's a seasoned traveller. He is. He's very calm, collective and ready to go. Oh, other campers all now turning up. So, um... Can you case the shun the off his? Yeah. So we're just now... Waiting to board. Got my oh. birthday cards up as it's my birthday today. Teddy bear. Oh, so interesting, Teddy. You've gone to sleep. Asleep. <laughs> you just sleep there, Teddy. That's a good boy. So, all going well. This is the last major step out of the UK and into France. Exciting! Celebrating on board Euro Tunnel <laughs> with a piece of birthday cake because it's my birthday today. <laughs> Do you want a bit of steaming? Yes please. <laughs> Happy birthday Nina. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> we can't do our We can't do champagne. So. <laughs> Got cake instead. <laughs> Check on the girls, give them some food and water. We've had many stops, so they're doing well. And I'm pleased, all combs are still looking bright red. Definitely eating well. Charlotte, show yourself. There you go. Sweet. Beatrice, you got to share. Beatrice is like Queen Bee. She thinks she has to have all the food first. The sun's just starting to come out. We look really scruffy. We've had a tired time now. Um, yeah, all going well. Um, we was we got on the train. Uh, no, just before the train, we got through to custom bit. And we was holding our breath to see what they'd do. We'd done our passports and suddenly a man at the end 
Sig like go to the side so it's like oh no we're going to get done now they're going to find chickens and all the things we've smuggled in <laughs> and um, they said they wanted to check our do a gas check gas, <laughs> the gas turned off. do a gas check and make sure the gas was turned off so a man went to the back of the truck Stephen opened it up and um he was the man was fiddling around with the valve for the gas. Ted was sitting on the bed and went Oof, all at him. And then that was about it. And he said, Oh, see his guards in the van. And all I was thinking is, you don't want to be looking underneath him. There's <laughs> three chickens hidden in there. <laughs> and uh, but yeah, then he closed it all up we went and we still just held our breath then to find out if we're actually through or um yeah or if they was going to drag I across two borders done the french and the spanish border yeah one more border to go yeah they're now nearly portuguese chickens <laughs> and uh yeah so we're getting there but um We've got a lot of stuff on board though, including one tent. We just look like we've got one big bed in here. But underneath that bed contains barbecue, a big one, two kayak canoes. What else we got under there? Two garden chairs, two, three garden chairs. Three garden chairs, a deck chair, a radiator. Six steps of super two wood <laughs> yeah lemps of wood 3,000 tea bags <laughs> and two kilos of um, tea. loose tea leaf um, 20 litres of paint <laughs> 20 litres of paint 50 metres of electric cable 50 metres of electric cable um, and a, like, a gallon of wood cup. I've had to hide loads of clothes around things to hide stuff um, oh, the MIG welder! Oh, the MIG welder! <laughs> I got a big welder under there. Um, six demijohn glass. Oh, yeah, the demijohn glass bottles and the way wine making stuff. And on the roof, there's two iron gates oh, and about eight precision gates strapped to the roof. Yeah, <laughs> all the metal poles. loads of things. Right, I've got to help Stephen now because of the traffic and things. So I'm going to go. But yes, we're in España. So but you can see there's houses down there I think. But other than that, yeah, this is our, our long journey. But we're nearly there, it's nearly over. Well, they've still got their appetites and drinking well. Uh, combs are looking okay. Drinking well. All right, B. And Dorothy. Where's Charlotte? Come on, Charlotte, have a drink. No, back in, good girl. Not at the moment, darling. We stay in there. A little bit longer. Hello. It's lovely and sunny here. Lots to do, lots to do. But look, grass is so long. And the chickens. Who's having a... He's having a good old crow. Let's go and see what they're doing. Hello. Which one of you lot's having a good crow? They've uh, 
Come on, MB. Has somebody just laid me an egg? Hey? Let's have a look. You've made a lot of noise. Let's go and find out. Whoops. Nope, nothing in here. They're being quite, quite lively. It's quite warm for them, and um, because it's gone from cold, that they have suddenly got heat. Let's see. Uh, I think down in that one. I think you lot are just warming me up, aren't you? I had one without a shell on it where a bit of shock where they'd um, must probably um, just lay in for the first time, oh, well the, after the drive but I've had quite a few eggs that are, uh, I've had yeah one egg without a shell on it and I've received one this morning and there was one when the box was in when the box was in the van when I got them out so but yeah they've got let's see let's go down to their garden they've got this is all their garden and their little bits over there so they've got quite a lot to roam in at the moment and then as as we cut the grass we will as we cut the grass, we get them. They can have a roam out there. <laughs> really noisy at the moment, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, so new. Well, there's plenty for them to do here. They've been right having a scratch around. Um, see you in a minute, girls. Look, it's a waist high. <laughs> it's up to my waist. <laughs> so, turn up and turn this meadow into a garden <laughs> a blossom some of our other things haven't done so well that we've planted I think we've just too much too soon got their own complete the netting is into concrete so it's it's a real tough one so they're quite safe in there and I've put their box inside there one to keep it cooler but two then I can close their house and also the gate just in case there are a lot of wild things here at the moment that we're not 100% sure of yet so you know, but it will enough to want to eat chickens. <laughs> but yeah, they're yeah, pecking away lovely. They're, you know, really being <laughs> inquisitive and playing. They sleep well tonight. going to have to miss this morning. <laughs> morning Stephen. Morning. Swimming through the boxes. <laughs> yeah it's, it's a little bit overpacked and we don't know where to start yet. We've been doing some indoors and sorting out but everywhere we look 
<coughs> there is just boxes and stuff. Um, um, yeah, we're just trying to set up as much as we can now. So it's taken me ages. It looks like it's doing good, but everywhere I look, there's like boxes. It is hot today out here at the moment. Oh, what's the temperature? Ooh, uh, ooh, 29 <laughs> up in the 80s. But it looks like it. it might not be, it's just on a sunny wall. But we're getting, we're just trying to sort out the telly area. But we've started to get things in. And it's all got too much. So I made myself a massage room. Let me see if I can turn this camera around so you can see. So I'm just trying to sort out this room. So that would be all set up in there. So it'd be like a calm room. So just trying to do that. The bar's coming together. Chickens are doing well. They're actually laying eggs. So they must be doing well. Um, let's see if I can find my man that does his jobs. So, oh, very warm. But yeah, everywhere we look, there's just boxes and um, the grass is like up to our waist um more boxes there this is for stephen's workshop ben i don't know where he is hang on oh he's walked up the road oh there's a big bug away oh get off <laughs> sorry about that uh, but yeah boxes everywhere this is gonna be the new bar so we're just sorting out all here. Daz is looking a bit dusty. <laughs> Ted's doing not too bad. A bit lonely, sad, but he's okay. Oh, I better sort my plants out. They look like they're struggling. Uh, I think Stephen's gone to walk to the post. Uh, no, he's gone to walk to the rubbish bin. So he's gone down there. But yeah, we're doing all right. Thanks for watching. And if you like what you've seen, please like, subscribe and follow our story as we move into Portugal. Don't forget to smash that bell. <laughs> Don't forget to smash the bell. <laughs> Cheers. Bye.